My name is Su Chi, and I'm a cat. I'm a female cat actually, but my voice has been disguised for privacy reasons because this tape is going on the internet. My favourite occupation of all is to sleep, and if there were an Olympics for this, I could sleep for Australia. Here I'm enjoying Sunday morning. Occasionally my claw gets stuck, but I know that my slave will always be there to remove it for me, should it prove necessary. I live in a strange house where photographic equipment appears to be the main decoration. Suddenly an idea occurs to me. I know. I'm going to stretch my lat. Only the right one, as you can see, and then I relax again. My second most favourite activity is licking and nibbling on various parts of myself. Here I'm working on my left hand. In a sudden burst of activity, I head outside. The outside of our house is lovely too, and we have grapevines, and I'm particularly fond of sleeping at the bottom of the grapevine. And the interesting thing is that when I'm asleep, not even the sound of a chainsaw can disturb me. Here there's some idiot over the back garden revving one like there was no tomorrow, and I just keep sleeping. Suddenly I feel the need for a burst of activity. I know, I'm thirsty. So I'll head off to the little drink bowl which lives in the corner and is reserved just for me. When the dogs start barking loudly outside, this is when I find that I need to lick myself the most often. And the neighbour's dogs are pretty stupid. They bark all the time. When that activity goes though, I'm back to my other favourite, sleeping. And licking. This time, it's the right hand. Notice how I really get into it too. And my last activity that I love is exploring and I'll, I'll use any excuse for sticking my nose in anywhere. Back to licking, don't you wish you had that kind of flexibility? My motto in life is absolutely no unnecessary tension. My favourite person in the whole world is my slave. Here you can see I'm humouring her by dancing with her, something she likes to do from time to time. She's very musical actually, and also she tastes pretty good as well. So here I'm giving her the benefit of my sandpaper tongue. There's absolutely no mistaking that sensation. Yuck! It's great to be a cat. It's good.